Our modern society and the lives that we lead today are actually built on the disasters of the first half of the 20th century. And World War II is perhaps the greatest disaster of all, and actually could not have been won by Europe alone. Pearl Harbor was necessary to fully convince America in one blow to join the war. They fight to let justice arise and tolerance and goodwill among all thy people. They yearn but for the end of battle, for their return to the haven of home. Some will never return. They're lying there in faraway Holland. Are they being cared for? I, for one, think that it's absolutely incredible what so many people, particularly in Limburg, have done. We can that like near Clifton. We're about to go to Clifton Rivers, and I think it's really special that the school adopted him. Thanks in part to America, we now live free. They fought for our freedom, as did he. Because this man gave his life for you and me, and thanks to him, we all can now live free. When I'm at Margraten with my children, laying flowers on the grave of Harold J. Ball is another way to not only tell something about those soldiers and what I know about them, but also about the war, the horrors of war, and that we never want this to happen again. I received your letter of August 27th pertaining to the personal property of my son, Harold G. Ball. Please to omit the flag when you send his belongings to me. And the most pressing question for me, of course, was, was he or wasn't he in Normandy? That's what it was, in fact, Montgomery's vanity that had caused all the misery of Market Garden. If there's one lesson we can learn from the post-war period and the disasters of the first half of the 20th century, it is that a society benefits from that freedom, freedom of research, free thought, and freedom to develop various alternatives, in this case, to work together with each other, that you must always nurture and protect that freedom. What's crazy is that, while we have learned a lot from that, it still seems as if there are so many people who learned nothing at all. Thank you.